It is now feature time. The mighty modifieds are now ready to rumble. Racing. championship feature for 2023 at Georgetown Speedway is underway and Rocky Warner will grab the early lead as they rocket down the back straightaway and we've got a battle three wide for position number two. Warner bringing him up at turn number four. Danny Buck sliding up in front of Herthler for a second and Mike Mahaney under Herthler. Herthler will go three wide as Austin Hubbard gets up on the outside and Danny Buck running Rocky Warner down down the back stretch. Here they come off the corner down the straightaway. Ryan Watt battling Mike Wooler and Billy Pouch Jr. into the turn. Wooler, Pouch, Watt. Then we got Ryan go down. Anthony Perego, Stewart Friesen, Matt Shepard. Following him down the back is Danny Barron. Up front we got a battle for the lead now. Danny Buck to the outside of Rocky Warner will take the lead. Top three right together as Danny Buck races around the outside of the flying squirrel. Rocky Warner and into the lead. Here comes Hubbard around Mahaney and in the third. Down the back straightaway, Matt Shepard gets a good restart. He goes around the outside of Y. Whoa, Friesen's off the racetrack over there. That'll cost him big. Friesen got off the edge of the racetrack. He drops back several spots. But I was going to say Shepard gained a few spots on the restart. He got by Watt. And he had moved up behind Friesen. But Friesen slid off the track. And Shepard is now behind. Goes around Billy Jr. He's now ahead of him entering the third turn. He'll slip into position number four, and Matt Shepard gets around the 170 to Herthler and the number two of Mike Cooler. 19 laps in the books. We're one lap from halfway. Danny Buck opening up his lead, just picking right back up where he left off. Rocky Warner holding on the second, but now it's Ryan Godown. He gets by Mahaney and Hubbard, and Godown now is putting the pressure on Warner for second. Halfway off the corner for Danny Buck down the straightaway. Rocky Warner looks like he might have something wrong in the right front of that car. Godown, after getting by Mahaney, will slide by Rocky Warner. He'll pick up second spot. Oh, go down, pulls a slider as he blasts into turn number one and grabs the lead for a brief second. Buck hits the binders, goes back underneath him, and Gree takes the lead. Go down, tries another bonsai move, can't pull it off, and Danny Buck maintains the lead. Mahaney in intense battle now with Shepard. Shepard in the inside, Mahaney on the outside, side by side battle out of turn number two. Mahaney will pull away from Shepard briefly as they enter turn number three. Shepard dives underneath again, side by side battle out of the corner. Shepard and Mahaney. Shepard will try to inch in front. He will do so over turn four. And we got a car over the berm in turn number three. Turn three, that is Austin Hubbard in the 65. And this time he's got Shepard on his back bumper. Might be a two for one here. Danny Buck leading him off a of four, and we are green. A little problem on the front stretch. Look out. Red out two flips in turn number one as the cars all piled up together. Okay, it started further up the track. Mike Gouler got together with another car. He saved it, but then he and Jimmy Horton got together. And then Stangle got into the back of Grasso, and Weiss got into the back of him. And Weiss got it. it just One just kept piling into the other. And 11 laps to go in the Mid-Atlantic Championship for 2023. Big to the Sunoco starting zone. We go green. Back underway, Danny Buck once again getting out in front, this time leaving no chance at go down getting a slider as he drives off two car lengths, make it three as they enter turn three. Buck tried a little bit different strategy that time, went low and one to block off any possible slider. He maintains the lead, begins to pull away. Go down now, is gonna have to deal with Matt Shepard into the corner. Shepard and go down side by side out of the turn, working down the back straightaway, Matt Shepard and Ryan go down side by side into turn three. Shepard go down, throwing down right here as he looks. Shepard looks back low, but it's go down, racing around the top side and back in the second. Danny Buck's got a comfortable lead, almost a half a straightaway now over go down and Shepard. The Mid Atlantic Championship race weekend for 2023. Last season, Danny Buck won the small block race. He won the makeup Camp Barnes race, but the Mid Atlantic Championship eluded him. This year, he will take home the checker, a first career short track Super Series win.
for Danny Buck in the Mid-Atlantic Championship. Go down and Shepard will be two and three.